Hello, this is HK from HK's Video Log, and tonight we are reviewing Stone Sour's new album, Hydrograd. And uh, yeah, stay tuned after the intro. Let's go. So uh, I got pretty excited today because I learned that uh, one of my favorite bands of all time uh, made a new album, and uh, it's Stone Sour. And uh, I'm a big fan of Corey Taylor, so that, yeah, that music fits me right. And uh, it starts off great. Uh, my notes, my notes, they say, great vocals. Uh, it's a rare gift to know how to growl and sing clean at the same time. Yeah, diversify. Uh, powerful sound. It's a dirty sound, not too polished. That's great. And uh, there's a song called K uh, Knievel Has Landed. I don't know uh, if it has any other meaning than Evil Knievel and Landed. And he landed on his face most of the time. Um, cool title, it says, every time I fall, uh, yeah, uh, and then it starts uh, to get weird for me, because uh, I think it's song number five, and uh, it's called song number three, if I'm not mistaken, and uh, it reminds me of a 80s metal, and that can be cool, but yeah, it doesn't seem like the song fits in the album. I mean, uh, he's, he sings like Corey, and uh, the music around, the melody, everything just reminds me of 80s metal. If you search YouTube for a band called Return, it just, yeah, just reminds me of that. I don't know why. Uh, just different. Can be good. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, the S really hits the fan for me. Just for me. And that is a song called Saint Marie. Uh, I don't know uh, what's wrong or what happened here, but suddenly you have a country song. That's weird for me. So that's when I stopped listening to the album. Maybe that was a mistake, but I'll tell you one thing for sure. I'm never, ever going to listen to this album again. Because I'm very picky when it comes to music. And uh, when you have a rock album, uh, and you're a hard rock band like Stone Sour, and suddenly you play country music, is it to show off the guitarist's skills on the lap steel guitar? Or is it Corey Taylor trying to show off his voice? To me, it's just a waste of space on an album. Yeah. I know uh, some people are gonna hate me on uh, YouTube for saying that. Because uh, Corey Taylor is sacred. He is, uh, he is almost like Jesus. But uh, I don't care. If I don't like it, I don't like it. Could be Jimi Hendrix uh, that made a mistake, but I wouldn't. If I didn't like it, I didn't like it. Anywho, if I have to scale this uh, album, you know the artwork on the, on the uh, album cover is good, I think. And uh, on the deluxe album, there's 28 songs. And I just, just have to say, up until Saint Marie, that's number 10, the guitar player, the lead guitar, plays the same solo. He just varies the speed. It's the same pattern, same notes, all the time. It gets old. You know, if you're a guitarist, try to... Try to do something else. I play guitar, a little guitar. I play uh, the first thing I learned was the blues scale. I mean, my God, it's so annoying on every song except for Saint Marie. But uh, you could still use the same pattern on the, la on the lap steel guitar. 
But uh, if I have to scale this album from, uh, my, I mean, don't get me wrong, there's one or two songs that are really cool, but you know, as a whole album, I don't, I don't get it. It just doesn't fit. It, yeah, the pieces doesn't fit. And I know they're good musicians, but what the hell happened? You know? And uh, if you want to leave a hate comment, then just do that. I don't care. Please subscribe. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna review uh, a lot of bands and a lot of uh, music. And uh, yeah, don't hate me for this. But uh, if you listen to it yourself, you, you'll get what, I, what I'm saying. Anyway, from uh, one to ten, I rate this album. Uh, yeah, I don't want to be too harsh because there are great musicians. Uh, I rate this album six. So it's worth listening to if you just want to listen to it. But if you if you want to listen to a great album, and this is not it. I'm sorry. It's just the way it is. So uh, yeah. But don't take my word for it. Listen to the music and uh, hit me back with a comment and tell me what you think. I'm open to suggestions. I'm open to that I could be wrong. But. Uh, yeah, I like what I like and I didn't like it. Um, yeah. So uh, please leave a comment and, uh, and uh, subscribe. And I'll talk to you later. Goodbye. HK out.